I think my wife is a skinwalker. My wife and I just recently welcomed my sweet daughter into this world, but I've got a bad feeling she may not be as sweet as she seems to be to me. But to understand why I'd say that about my own daughter I need to give a little backstory to the situation. We haven't been married very long, as it's not really frowned upon to marry soon in my family. But, when we were first dating and staying with my parents, we slept in their living room and when we woke up one morning I noticed the door was still unlocked, but I was always sure to keep it locked. I never really noticed anything else though. I never saw any handprints on the door or windows, I never saw anything out of the ordinary at all that would be a telltale sign of an intruder. I brought it up to my dad so he took me to his office to check the CCTV monitor. No one had approached the house all night. In fact, everything was eerily still except for a very large cat that would always hang out in their yard. That cat had been around for a long time though. We always thought maybe it was a neighbor's cat because we lived out in the back country of Texas and there were other people out in the woods. But growing up there I did actually notice a lot of things that scared the shit out of me. I once saw my cat, Salem, shape-shifting right in front of my eyes when my little cousin and I were playing soldiers near the woods. One of the old men down the road would tell us stories of a panther that would kill people's horses but I wondered if it was really my shape-shifting cat or something. My dad also told me a story of a man that lived on our land before we did that killed his daughter's bus driver for what she said he did to her one day when, she came home crying. And he would see the ghost of that dad standing over him when he slept with a blood-stained shirt and evil radiating from his eyes. And of course countless other stories of all sorts of things that go bump in the night. More recently I've noticed odd smells originating from under our house when I'm out working around the yard. I've also noticed a greater number of flies, and carrion birds. I was hoping a lost dog or some large rodent had just crawled under there and died. But one day I found the promise ring I had given her that she said she lost before we even moved to this house. It looked extremely old now and caked with mud. I started nosing under the house near where the ring was laying, and I found a large indention on the earth as if something was laying there but had been moved. Soon after that day she surprised me with the news that we were going to be parents, and I've been so excited at first until I realized something. I just knew my initial suspicions were proven true when she got pregnant, you see, my wife warned me right away not to expect children because of an accident she had when she was small. She was infertile, 